Hey guys, this is Blue Tea Support, a knowledge base to help you have a better experience with Blue Tea. Today, we're introducing you to the AC200P's intuitive LCD display. This touchscreen is a multifunctional display for real time machine status, system settings, and more. Press this and you can check the battery voltage, current, state of charge, and BMS state. Press this and select on, then you're good to use the AC outlet. To confirm how the AC outlets work, press this AC load button. Here you'll see the output power, voltage, current, power, and frequency. Select off, you've turned off the AC power. Check out the DC power, select on. Also, press DC load. You'll see the total output power and voltage, as well as the information of every output. Press PV slash car. You can view the PV and car input voltage, current, and power. Pay attention here. AC200P accepts a PV input of 35 to 150 volts. Please use appropriate solar panels, for example, two or more PV200s. Press Adapter. You can view the AC input voltage, current, and power. Enter Settings. You may need to adjust the voltage and frequency for first use. Now it's the default setting for the US. The DC input source, just as the name suggests, is to set the correct DC input source. For solar and dual AC charging, you need to choose PV. For car and lead acid battery charging, choose car. AC200P also has an eco mode, and we advise you to turn it on to save power. Press next to change the system language and date. You can also enable the buzzer. Turn it on and it will beep if there's something wrong. Please set the system date for the first use. Back to the home page. Enter the data page where you can check the product information, inverter and charger information, and BMS maintenance, as well as the fault history. Here, you can view a record of all generated errors. This screen will also show you what problem your AC200P has. If there is any error, please contact our customer service with the error. That's all for today. Please follow us for more videos and let me know if you have any questions or ideas. Thanks for watching and see you next time.